Alrighty, so we're here. We're going to talk about some trailers and stuff. Kicking it off with the goddamn Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I, 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 I'm man enough to admit it. I had tears. <laughs> yeah, oh, had some man. tears. Had some man tears coming down. Dude, I, I just okay. woke up like a few minutes ago and I saw it. I was like, I, holy shit. I just shit. want to say, in 2006 when they announced Iron Man was coming, B-list character at that point. Yeah. Now A-list. Guardians of the Galaxy are pretty much what you consider the cream of the crop for D-listers. Yeah, that's oh, yeah. that's pretty deep into comic continuity if you know who the Guardians of the Galaxy and are. Not only that, like, oh, oh my god, like, let's uh, just just talk about everything you see. Like, Rocket Raccoon, let's start off there. Looks oh my god. Yeah. I was not expecting him to look that for, good. For 13 days of shooting, they got him looking perfect. It's... Uh, I don't like know what to what to say. Like I, I just want to stand up and clap at my computer. You know, I was like, this I, is beautiful. You know, I actually thought like a lot of people said that they were gonna use like a practical effect for Rocket, but I was like, I was expecting like a fucking sock puppet for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm it, Rocket Raccoon. Let's go on I, an adventure. But when I saw it, I was like, holy shit, dude! It's like 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 all the detail on them and stuff like that. Even though it's kind of unfinished, but it still looked really really good. You know, it's funny. I was almost apprehensive with the trailer because. I'm like, eh, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy. I, I, I'm kind of excited. Then I watch the trailer. Joel, I'm like, okay, I'm super excited now. I was gonna say, if you say the wrong thing right now, you're treading on very thin water to being kicked out of here. Very thin. <laughs> I was like, get him the fuck out. <laughs> you're, you're fucking. Ass. I, I'm, I'm literally. I've been speechless all day. Like, I don't know what to say since I saw that. Like, there's, you know, watching the footage, seeing how good it looks. Seeing the different feel, like every Marvel movie oh, yeah, has a yeah. different vibe to it. Very this, much so. This is straight up what I picture science fiction adventure movies to look Same. like. Same. It's but oh, when yeah. I look at it there, I'm like, wow, this doesn't feel like any of the Marvel movies. It really done. doesn't. This feels like a, if I didn't know this was based on a comic, I would say this was something completely original. Yeah. Yep. And that's what Marvel are doing right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're not Take trying that, to, Lucas and DC. They're not trying to bring one feel to the entire universe because Never that's a terrible idea. What they're thing, doing yeah. is they're melding the feel with an overarching universe. Yeah, it, it's it's what you know. They they tried it with Alien vs Predator and it failed because they got terrible directors and they mm. try to meld movies that weren't. You know, they're doing it here. Like when you see Groot in that trailer, that's oh great. my god! Shit. Oh man. Like, that Oops. was Groot, legitimately. So, you know, it's... And, and perhaps the best CGI creation, uh, John C. Riley. I mean, he looked great. <laughs> he looked out of this He world. looked like John C. I am... Oh, my God. Thank God you it... said that, because I was blown away with how good his face looked. I know. I mean, to think he's just a puppet, am I right? <laughs> that he's not real, that he's one of the Muppets. That's know, right? the ghost of I mean, Jim dude, Henson. I saw the string, but it was great. It was good. <laughs> And funny, too, I'm glad that they're keeping that up, because the first little bit that we saw looked really serious, like, uh, really dour. No, but then yeah, they like, get a great uh, joke in there at the end. We're like, what the fuck uh, are these here's guys? Here's my thing, right? Uh, they're playing Hooked on the Feeling, which is an old song. Mm -hmm. And when this movie was first announced, there was a couple leaks going around saying, this will be a time travel piece. Like, it's gonna, mm -hmm. So could this possibly take place in space in the 70s? Oh, oh, that oh. also lends to the props we saw at Comic Con because um, uh, Star Lord had a Walkman, like a tape. Exactly. Walkman. <laughs> now, how do we feel about that to do uh, space and time travel all in the same movie? Do you think that's pushing it? Do you think that's putting too many it's eggs? It's James in Gunn. I trust him with everything. Oh, but yeah. he is a like when it comes to science fiction and making sense of nothing. James, you can, you know why they got James Gunn to do this. Like, you know why I like James Gunn? Because I genuinely think he's a crazy person. Oh, he, that's why oh, I think he's, he's perfect he's for this. Insane. He, he's insane. He, like, he is genuinely out of his mind. Like, hey, here's a talking raccoon. He's like, I'll make it work. <laughs> <laughs> I, talking I raccoon, slither. that's perfect for my craft. Pretty much. I'll do it. I, I did trauma movies. <laughs> well, he did Tromeo and Juliet, didn't he? Yes, he did. That's He's had the, a very yeah. interesting career, and oh, I wrote Scooby Doo, <laughs> which was uh, which was a really weird, really out there Scooby Doo movie. If you remember, oh, yes, it really was. It was I would have so... loved to have known what his original draft of that was. I mean, out oh. of the entire uh, 
trailer, you know, the quick glimpses we got. What what was your guys' highlight of everything? Uh, Drax flexing. D- that was pretty decent. <laughs> Friggin' Rocket Raccoon, man. How could I yeah. not say that? We're getting Rocket Raccoon before we're getting Wonder Woman. How sad is that? That's very sad. I like the Star-Lord bits, like where, where he's in the mask. Mm. Mm-hmm. He's shooting the shit out of everything. That's good stuff. To me, like, I was I was genuinely surprised when they show Star-Lord walking through the scenery. Yeah, just yeah. Just how the planet and everything looked. And I'm just like, oh, wow, that's... Yeah. This movie's yeah, gonna I, be a visually stunning, well, not masterpiece, but it's gonna be fucking cool. Oh, no, wow. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be as close to a sci-fi masterpiece as we're gonna get now, from again, any comic book. Let's remember, before we completely spooge all over this, trailers tend to lie. Yeah. That yeah. being said, the trailer has done its job, and I am thoroughly hyped up for it. Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, let, let us not forget the Green Lantern debacle, which every time we get excited uh, for the trailer. But, I but must Joel, that was, that was DC. Yeah. And it looked good, though. You go back and you watch that second and, and trailer, also, it looks freaking amazing. Joel, do you have to be a buzzkill every goddamn time? Yes, I'm the master of the backhanded comment. Look, or, you know um, what? I'm just I'm just picturing Drax flexing um, <laughs> this whole time. And I can't get you down because you're, you know, picturing dudes flexing. <laughs> yeah, exactly, because it's Drax, man. I, I just really want them to have Drax be, like, a complete murderous asshole. <laughs> uh, so, absolutely Drax, love that. Um, was there any other... Tra- well, there was. Uh, we got X-Men Days of Future Past, which I pretty much snored through the whole fucking I thing. Oh, that, that looked boring as shit. Is, is, is it yeah. gone already? Because I missed it. Yeah, there's nothing to see. Oh, it's really? literally, here's Singer, here's Wolverine, it's exactly what I said, they transfer his mind back into the 70s, and Xavier has to, Xavier pretty much has to have Wolverine teach him what to do. So it's a, hey, look how cool uh, friggin' Wolverine is again. Yep. Yep. Uh, Did you it, expect anything else? So I woke up and I, I watched not. that, and I got really disappointed, and then... The Power Rangers trailer. Yeah, oh, that looked awesome. To me- Super Mega Force, and that blew my mind. <laughs> Super Mega Force, which is of course taking its cues from the Pirate Sentai, which uh, one of the things of that series was that they could literally turn into old Power Rangers. So not only are we going to be seeing that, but we're going to be seeing the legendary Great War and Rangers we have never seen in North America. And, and we saw that in the trailer. We did, and the the fights look amazing. I mean, the acting has never been great in Power Rangers, but at least it's nice to know when, you know, uh, Captain Robot and the blonde chick and the other one are done talking to each other. <laughs> that we can get a cool action scene, because I'm digging it, then they show the cast from Megaforce, and I'm like, oh, yeah, I forgot about you people. <laughs> <laughs> They're very forgettable. I, I no just wanted to bring back the fat kid and his bugs. Yeah, me too, I love that guy. No matter how small, <laughs> everything deserves respect. I love that fucking line. I don't give a shit. It's cheesy <laughs> as all hell. You're going to get that on your jacket. Sean's going to wear that jacket. I'm going to get that on my wall. <laughs> going to get it, edge it in there. <laughs> Was there anything else? No, I think those were the three. No, that's it. I just really wanted to talk about Guardians of the Galaxy and how epic it looked. And uh, James Gunn is going to kill. I swear to God, when they show this teaser trailer with Thor, I, I am literally going. I, it, oh, it's going to be bad. I hope now. they show this one because this one will get everyone hyped. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is oh, definitely. Oh, wait. And then like, DC's hey, going to yeah. announce Secret Six. But no, they're not. <laughs> Oh. Yeah. <laughs> like Rick Berlanti. <laughs> oh, you like, get my bro. hopes up just to tear me down. Hey guys, Guardians of no, the Galaxy no, no, no. Guys, has guys. been announced. This Beast trailer Star- definitely didn't compare to a logo on the screen. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we'll come back with more. Please, please, a higher quality leak, please. <laughs> <laughs>